Hi everyone, my name is Joseph Stippen. This is our introduction discussion um, video for our new uh, spring uh, semester class at Arizona State University. Um, so let's get into it. Uh, my current location, I am currently living in Vancouver, Washington uh, with my wife. Uh, we live in an apartment complex in uh, the Camas area. Um, it's like Vancouver, Camas, like in the border area. Uh, right by Union High School, if anyone knows where that would be. Um, I grew up in Portland, Oregon, um, up till I was about in fifth grade. And that's when I moved to Vancouver, and I've lived here ever since. Um, I've kind of dealt with the rain, and I'm still not completely used to it. But I've come to accept that it rains pretty much 10 out of the 12 months of the year. Uh, my educational background, I graduated from Washington State University. Um, WSU in 2019 with a Bachelor of in Digital Technology and Culture. Um, I'm currently in my third semester of the MED program of Learning Design and Technology. I'm enjoying every second of it and uh, yeah I can't wait to graduate and um, I'm learning learning something new every day with this uh, program. Uh, what I do for a living, I'm currently a freelancer for any company that's looking to upgrade the websites, um, create new, wanting new logos, um, any designs in particular or video production. Um, I've created logos for individual companies such as Columbia Freight Systems located in Portland, Oregon, and uh, a application company called Toolbelt um, in close to downtown Vancouver area. Um, these are some of the designs I've done, just a few of the designs I've done. Um, I've made a little flyer thing for tool belt um, around before my uh, before my departure and then I also created um, the new logo for Columbia Freight Systems which they um, happily displayed on uh, their wall and I thought that was really cool and then I've also um, created a video um, for a food donation organization called need it should be on YouTube if you'd like type in need and then like Jim Stippen, it should pop up. Um, so that's been really cool. I met a lot of nice homeless people and uh, I helped donate food um, for a couple of weeks and it was just a really great experience. Um, and I'm also creating my own t-shirt business on the side. It's still taking off there. It's um, We're currently creating an Etsy account uh, where we'll sell them, but it's called Beeping Nerds. And that's one of the design at the top called Welcome to Washington. It's based off of um, the popular Nintendo game Animal Crossing. Um, I also have made some other designs as well, but that's just one of them. Uh, my career goes, goals, excuse me. I'm hoping one day to become a high school digital technology instructor. Um, the oper I've always been really good with kids and they've always looked up to me no matter what age or um, grade or anything like that. And um, there's a huge passion for the digital world and for me, I always grew up, you know, being told to either be a doctor or um, be something that I really didn't want to be. And that, you know, wanting to get into the video, the film industry and all that stuff was just a waste of time. Um, and then I went to Washington State University, um, who where all the professors inspired you to want to educate yourself on this stuff. And if I could be a high school teacher to let the people that have this need for it or this passion for it um, instead of, you know, all these high schoolers, t uh, teachers or the parents telling them no, but then have me tell them yes, I could get them on the right path um, for college so they're not wasting time at like a community college just getting their AA degree or, or their associates and they could just go pers pursue photography or something like that. Um. For my communication style, I'm definitely personal. Um, I have plenty of experience as a group leader. I was the head designer for Toolbelt for a short time. Um, I'm also was the lead designer in uh, Columbia Freight Systems. I actually had the um, the title creative director. Um, I also tend to bring laughs and positive energy to my groups that I um, am assigned with. Um, I listen to every outcome and approach to a project. I figure out what the best solution is. Um, and I also look for the best creative solution. Uh, what can we do that make this fun? What would we do to make this unique compared to everyone else's um, designs or uh, projects? 
Uh, what I hope to learn. Um, not entirely sure what I hope to learn. I know that technology can improve remote learning and, you know, with COVID happening, this uh, technology has been a godsend for teaching. Um, so I'm really was kind of um, blown away by uh, the title of this class and the issues of online learning. Um, I get it that, you know, technology can uh, sometimes not work to our advantage, which hence the funny photo I added of a computer on fire. So I'm excited to see what this class brings. I'm not really sure what to expect, but I'm excited. Um, something interesting, interesting about me, um, I've had over 11 surgeries um, throughout my life. Um, I was born with no ball and socket joint, which is that um, bone right there that rotates your leg. Um, so I actually had to get a metal ball to almost um, replace or be the replacement for it. And uh, every year as I, or as I grew up, because I had it at such a young age, um, as my bones grew, I had to get it replaced with a bigger ball and socket joint or, or fake one um, until I stopped growing. So in total, I've had about 11 surgeries almost every year around my birthday. I had to get a surgery. So that was fun. Um, and that's me. So that's just a little bit about me. Um, like I said, I'm really fun going. Um, I'm a great um, people pleaser. I uh, do whatever I can to make everyone happy. Um, and I love interacting with people and meeting all these amazing people over this program. It's been phenomenal. So I'm looking forward to it. So thank you guys.